Downtown Chicopee will soon look a bit different. Under the shared winter streets and spaces program, the city received a $76,000 grant to add new walking and biking lanes. Western Mass News reporter Briseida Landa Verde has reaction from residents and a local business. New walking and biking lanes will soon be seen in downtown Chicopee. The city received a $76,000 grant under the state's Winter Streets and Spaces program, which will be used to create a six foot wide lane along the downtown streets of Exchange, Center, Chestnut, Front and Cabot. The idea is to provide a protected um, wider recreational loop for anyone who just is looking to get outside safely and walk or bike or get some sort of exercise in. One resident we spoke to is in favor of the project. I think it's excellent because if people have extra space to walk, you know, it'll be safer if something is happening or whatever in the streets. Jonathan Evans, the owner of Herbarium, tells Western Mass News he also supports the idea of more pedestrian traffic, but is concerned how a bike lane might impact his storefront. Having been here as long as we have, seeing the disruption that this kind of idea can cause, um, I'm a little leery. I'm also a little leery that someone decided this is good for business. A similar grant was awarded this past summer to Northampton. They used the money to build outdoor dining, which reduced on-street parking. And after many protests, the project was taken down. Lee Pouliot, the Director of Planning and Development for Chicopee, tells us during their proposal planning, it was really important for the city to preserve on-street parking and says it is why the six-foot lane will only be on one side. Um, and we understand that most businesses need um, some level of on-street parking to survive. A lot of our business storefronts don't have parking lots. The city is working alongside engineers and the Department of Public Works to finalize plans and make sure all the changes do not impact traffic. We just want to ensure that we have really great pedestrian and bicycle access to where we have operating businesses. And the project is expected to be completed by May 31st. For now, reporting in Chicopee, Brisita Verde for Western Mass News.